Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Sprintz here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Sunday, September 4th, 2022. Thanks to those of you who jumped on board yesterday. We won just about everywhere. Three and one in college football. We cashed the seven star play. We're now four and one, 80% on the season. We've hit a seven star, we've hit a five star. So both high end plays have won thus far. And we're now 11 and three in college football, 79% going back to late last season. So we'll look to keep it going this coming week. Uh, my next plays will be available on Thursday, and we'll have both college football in my NFL week one package available at that time. Uh, we also hit another parlay in baseball. We had a seven star parlay on Friday, a four star parlay on Saturday, up over $1,500 with those two parlays cashing just the last two days in Major League Baseball. Uh, also won an MLS action last night with Philly, a 2 nothing winner. It was a great night overall. Thanks, of, uh, thanks to those of you who did jump on board. I'm worn out, folks. I just did a three-hour show with Matt Humans over at Visa and a nice NFL preview, which I enjoyed. Been a couple of years since I've been in studio for a full show and uh, had a blast down at the Circa, which was wild. That place was packed wall-to-wall -wall people for the opening, really the opening full weekend of college football. It was a blast to be down there. On Sunday, I do have a couple of plays. Five-star play in Major League Baseball. One side today, no parley, but a side. We'll look to stay red hot. Again, up $1,520 the last two days in baseball. Five-star side in baseball. It's an afternoon play. I've got a three-star in the WNBA. Uh, we cashed a parley in the WNBA last time out with the Sky and with Las Vegas, a money line two-teamer. So we'll look to stay hot there. And then, of course, I've got a five-star play in NASCAR. We've won seven of our last nine NASCAR bets. And now 83 and 50, going back a couple of seasons here at DocSports.com, picking up $11,400. The circuit heads to Darlington, the lady in black, and I do have a five-star play. So a lot going on on Sunday, but again, thanks for checking us out with our plays on Saturday's card. We are happy to have delivered a very nice winning day. Let's get to the free play for today. It is the college football battle between Florida State and LSU. And while this number has gone up a little bit to basically three and a half, Still like the LSU Tigers here laying the points. Uh, one of the things that people talk about a lot is how, you know, a team that played a game the prior week, their first game of the season, has an advantage over the team that hasn't played as of yet. But that's not been the case over the last several seasons, betting-wise, the spread, because that's all baked into the number uh, behind the counter by the bookmakers, and that's the case here. And I still, again, don't think it's gone up enough with this point spread. And then also, when you look at Florida State, they're a little bit uh, hamstrung because they don't have any of LSU use game film with Brian Kelly as coach because this is uh, his debut with the LSU. Now they can look a little bit about what he did at uh, Notre Dame, but I like the quarterback situation. He's keeping it quiet. Uh, I think you're going to probably see both quarterbacks at some point in this game. Jaden Daniels likely to get the start, but uh, Neusmeyer will probably get some action in this game, or they could go vice versa on that because he has kept it close to the vest. But I like uh, uh, the, I almost said Notre Dame, I like the uh, LSU Tigers to get the win and the cover on on Sunday over Florida State. Don't forget, we got those plays going on in baseball, NASCAR, WNBA on Sunday. We look to finish off a red hot weekend. My homepage at DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on the thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprite, so let's put them in the wind column, everybody.